Electrofly's newest World War I ARF is the French Newport 11, and it's a standout for two big reasons. The first is that it offers the most true-to-scale look of any Electrofly World War I ARF to date, and the second is that enjoying the looks and performance requires amazingly little time and effort. Like Electrofly's other World War I ARFs, the Newport comes out of the box in sections. The all-wood wings, tail, and fuselage are not only pre-built, they're factory covered in colorful, durable monocoat film. Apply the included decal and finishing is complete. Other time savers include a pre-built motor box, pre-hinged aileron and elevators, and numerous molded and painted parts. The replica rotary engine that hides the motor installs in the time it takes to drive just a few screws. Add magnets within the cowl align it for easy installation and hold it securely in flight, yet release quickly for fast pack changes on the ground. While scaling out a kit can be time consuming, the scale details of the Newport ARF can be installed and admired in no time at all. The molded wing gun adds a lot to realism, but little to work. It mounts in pre-drilled holes and requires only a few drops of CA. The same is true of the tail skid. It looks like it was lashed in place with rope, but installs in seconds with CA. The cockpit windshield is factory painted and ready to install. The painted pilot bust is as well and comes complete with material for a scarf. Other details require no work at all, including the inspection plates and carb tubes on the forward fuselage and the combing around the cockpit. And what's more, the Newport flies just as good as it looks. Grab the Newport, your radio, and a couple of battery packs, and you have everything you need for a relaxing afternoon.